Jellaholics and Polishaholics. Today's nail art video was inspired by this um this cute little video that I saw on Facebook. So let me show you the video and and you'll see what I mean. Over the wrong socks. Tried the hot dogs here. <laughs> Needless to say, I didn't get my deposit. Needless to say, I didn't get my deposit. Back. Proud sponsor of Golden Good for Hot. Bad poor polar bear. I'll have the link to that video in the description box below. Super funny. Oh my gosh, I could barely stop keep from laughing while I was taping that for you guys. Um, but today's nail art is going to be this cute little polar bear nail art, which is super, super easy. And then as I was doing this video and watching that little bear clip and getting it all ready to put in this video, I just remembered something. Like last week, I had a bunch of time off around the Christmas holiday break. And um, last Tuesday, I was just on my way to work. And I really wasn't wanting to get up early to go to work anyway. But I walk out and I'm walking, you know, qu you know, quite a little ways on the sidewalk. And all of a sudden, there was like ice. And I completely did that Charlie Brown move where his feet fly out from under him and he lands flat on his back. That was me, and all of a sudden, when I'm watching that polar bear for like the hundredth time, all of a sudden it hits me, I'm like, oh my god, this has to be a theme here. Okay, we're falling on the ice, and I'm doing polar bear nail art, so. <laughs> it actually was really funny. I hurt my elbow, but. <laughs> it's got this huge bruise, um, but I'm really okay. <laughs> um, anyway, so let's get into the video. I want to show you how to make this nail art, so let's get going. Okay, so I will be using Wave Gel's Capricious Island, Top and Base Coat, Clean Slate, and Snow Ice. Assortment of dotting tools, this um, stamping plate that I got off of eBay with a bunch of snowflakes on it, the Bundle Monster Monocle Stamper, which I completely love, and the Scraper. And the Bundle Monster um, New Bam White Stamping Polish. And this Sally Hansen's Luxe Lace Glitter Topper. To start with, I have a base coat and two coats of Capricious, Capricious Island. And they each have been cured in between. I'm going to start with making the Polar Bear. Gonna start by making his head right here in the corner. And it's going to need two coats. Now that the first coat of the polar bear has been cured, we'll put another coat. On. And the good thing about using gel nail polish is if you don't like how he came out, you can just wipe them off and it's not going to hurt the underneath polish. Thank goodness I didn't try to do this with um, regular nail polish because I actually had to wipe him off a couple of times before I got the look that I liked. Okay, so let's darken up his ears a little. Although I think his ears are fine. Okay, so let me go and cure that. Okay, now it's time to put on his nose. So we'll just put his nose right here. Very cute. And then we want a couple of eyeballs.
so adorable. Let's see, do we want that in the inside of his ears? There! I think he looks very, very cute. So I'm going to go cure him. Everything is cured. I did not put a top coat on yet, but I did remove the tacky layer from the color coat. So now we're going to do the stamping. Okay, so we are just going to put the stamping polish on the plate, scrape it, pick up the image, and then I'm going to stamp it on my nail. Next, I'm just going to add a couple of little ones to this nail. And I think this one will be the last snowflake. Now I'm going to use this top coat, which is, a, it actually it's just snowflakes. I'm going to use these snowflakes, which is a regular nail polish. Um, coat and I'm going to put that on. I've taken off the sticky layer which is really important if you're going to put regular nail polish on over your nails because if any of that tacky layer gets on the brush into the bottle it will ruin the nail polish. So now we'll just put some of this on there and then we have to wait until it completely dries but then we'll be able to add the um, gel top coat. Okay, So I just want to add a few of these little white glitters over my polar bear. I got a big one on there, it won't come off. Oh, there it goes. Okay, slide it where I want it. Slide those other little guys around. And that one looks good. And I just want to brush some over by the snowflakes. I absolutely love this topper. I wish somebody would come out with it in a gel. I've been looking for quite a while that I haven't found anything. Oops. Okay, and I'll just finish up my other fingers and then wait until it dries and then we can add a top coat and cure. So now that everything is completely dry, we'll put the top coat on. I'll just finish that up and then cure it. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not one of my subscribers, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.